What's up everybody? Welcome back to another Versastyle dance tutorial. Today we're going to be working on popping using the head and neck. Let's get started. Perfect. 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 Okay, so using the head slash neck is, I think, really one that a lot of poppers and dancers in general just don't use because I think in the midst of it, we're thinking a lot. So then therefore, we're not really aware of like, where are we looking or where is our head dynamic um, and, and where is our, our whole body placement. So I think sometimes it's good to just work on specific body parts, yeah? And today I thought it would be nice to just work on nothing but just using the head and neck, okay? Now, for me, using the head and neck, I use it in a, in a way or idea of sometimes like misdirection. Yeah, so like if I wanna look, like if I'm popping, yeah, boom, bam, 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 and I look to the left, boom, I do have the choice to go wherever I'm looking, and that's the common sense, right? So if I'm looking to the right, boom, maybe that's when I wanna shift and come back, bop. If I wanna look to the left, bam, boom. Yeah, if I wanna look this way, maybe I'm gonna pop this way. But I also like to use it in a sense, if I'm looking here, boom, maybe I'm stepping away from that, from where I'm looking, yeah? If I'm looking down, boom, maybe I wanna throw my hands up. It just gives a different dynamic when you do utilize the head, yeah? So again, try to play with those things. Try to play with using the head when going the same direction. If you hear, boom, bop, boom, bop, yeah? If you hear, boom, bop, boom, bop. Yeah, and in the EB foundation, they do cate they categorize this as the neckle flex, yeah? Boom, ha, boom, bam. I'm not trying to do the neckle flex exactly. I wanna free us in a sense of using just the idea of using your head and neck, Bang. yeah? I also know, looking at more experienced dancers, they have that freedom just also, bam, just using that groove of it. Boom, ba, boom, bam, boom. Ga, da, da, boom, da, roll, bam, 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 boom, da, bam, boom, da. It makes it so much different instead of me just going doom, da, doom, da, doom, da. Yeah, I'm really playing with boom, 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 ha, 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 boom, ha, boom, boom, roll, slow, ha, bam, boom, da, damn. Yeah? Now, I know I'm using most of my body, right? I know I'm popping, right? But the whole idea is to not distract them, but to have their attention at this spectrum of my body, right? Having it here, bam. I also love to follow in a sense if I wanna use that swing motion, boom. How does it really ignite something? Bam, boom, da, yeah? Again, I can go boom, boom, ha, bam, boom. I love playing with misdirection. If I'm looking here, how do I shoot down? Bam. Boom, ba, boom, da, bam. It just keeps me guessing and it keeps whoever's watching guessing, yeah? So again, structure-wise, how do you just look from left to right? Now there's a difference between looking left to right and then also maybe using more of a funky roll and it's like a head roll in the EB foundation where you wanna just go boom. You can do up top, bam, same thing other way, boom. Bop, yeah? Even just playing around and just tilting the head. Boom, boom, bam, da, boom, ga, boom, da, boom. This is not even using shoulders. Boom, ha, boom, boom. Now I might be using shoulders and it brings even more of a dynamic because I'm breaking the body down, yeah? If you all, and I love to always um, throw out people's names uh, in terms of credit or in terms of inspiration for me, because again, this is my personal journey as well. If you can look up somebody named Popula, great dancer, great popper, but this dude uses his head in so many ways where it's just like you feel the funk, you feel the dance. It doesn't always have to be where you're like trying to put in a position. It could just be simply bobbing the head too. That's utilizing the head, yeah? So watch him, check him out if you can. I know he has an Instagram. You could definitely watch him on YouTube. So shout out to Popula, yeah? Um, but also one thing I wanna share with y'all is it forces you 
to maybe start gaining confidence. It forces you to look up. Yeah, again, like I said earlier in the tutorial, a lot of us, when we're dancing, we have like this 45 degree angle where we're always looking at the ground. Boom. And very rare are we looking either straight at somebody or the camera specifically or looking this way. So utilize that, check yourself. If you are dancing, whether you're sessioning, practicing with friends, or you're battling, if you find yourself here, that's probably meaning your head is not being, or your neck is not being engaged. So how from there? Boom, da, bam, boom, shh, boom, ka, da, boom, da, mm, wah, tru, bam, boom, pop, 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 boom, shh, bam, boom, sha, bam. Yeah? Utilize the head. It's one of the biggest body parts that we do not utilize when we're dancing because we're trying to cover from shoulders down, yeah? So these are ideas that hopefully you can play around with, practice, session, see what works for you, see what doesn't. Uh, but for now, let's build a little bit of a structure and then we'll go to some music, yeah? So, since I'm facing the camera and thinking like I'm facing a screen or a TV frame, whatnot, I'm gonna imagine that I'm looking at for me, corner left. I'm gonna look at up corner number left. So I can be in this position and here, bop. That's like my, my head look right there. I'll look like this at two counts. So I'll just be one, two. From there, I can shift my focus down, three, four. Then the next one could be one, two, three, four. So I'm literally going boom, 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 boom. Now, I don't have to put my energy there. I could just be simply boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, boom, boom. Just make sure you show this being utilized, yeah? So again, I have upper corner, lower corner, lower corner, upper corner. I'm gonna look straight, bam, right there. And then maybe I might just bring my chin all the way down to my chest, boom. And then I wanna look directly to my left, boom, and then directly to my right. But all in two counts. Let's just practice for two counts. So I'm not gonna do too much of the body, yeah? I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and. Just moving, boom, boom, ha. Now, you can go from here, boom, and maybe shift it down this way. You don't have to go strictly down. Be creative with it, yeah? Again, you can go from here, boom, and maybe you wanna roll, boom, ka, ka. Be creative, it's totally up to you, yeah? I might mess around, I might even throw a little bit of arms just to show different body positions and pictures, yeah? But it's not gonna be too crazy, okay? So again, it's just boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, sh, boom, sh, ba, uh. That's it, all right? Let's try it with some music, y'all. Let's go. Remember, have fun. Try to pop hard if you can, but move the head, all right? On my count. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, one more time, one more time. Here we go. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight. Bang. Yeah, one more time and then you're gonna freestyle afterwards, okay? Whatever you want for an eight count freestyle, okay? But first, let's do the structure. Here we go. And five, six, five, six, seven, and. All right, so before I let you go, just a couple tips, a couple reminders. Try to use the head, yeah? Again, it will force you to look up. It'll force you to possibly maybe look at somebody, maybe have a conversation with somebody since you're looking at that person. Remember, we are doing a social dance, okay? If it's a social dance, how do you tell your story of what you're doing within the popping context while looking, while boom, boom. Remember, there could be somebody up in the second balcony, whom? Boom, how do you look at that person and maybe dance for that person? There might be somebody that squat down there. How do you look down there? Boom, bop, and then you dance to them, bam. Using the head can also get you to move out of your comfort spot, yeah? Again, a lot of us, we're here. 
using the head because also you're doing misdirectional boom, it forces you to just go somewhere different. So use the head, utilize the head, watch yourself, film yourself sometimes, yeah? It's good to watch yourself and be like, oh, my head looks stagnant, my head doesn't look like it's just moving. Even if that's too much for you, how do you just even enjoy just rocking side to side? Because majority of the time, most people will understand this language. So even when you're popping, bam, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka. I have a little bit of a rock, yeah? Hopefully that helped you all. Again, would love to see some uh, videos. You can tag us on Versastyle LA. Um, but until then, thank you very much. Be on the lookout for the next one. And I hope you all have a good day. Peace.